All right, guys, so made my bed, did my little morning cleanup as you saw, made some tea, had some cereal, and now it's time to get ready for my day. Today is actually Wednesday. It's the exact day after you guys saw me unbox my new chair. If you guys watch that vlog, this one. So today's the next day, today's Wednesday. I've also been enjoying Pellegrinos lately. Like, they're so refreshing to my soul. It's like the mineral water is so good. I don't know why. So good. My makeup is done and that was so fast I literally do my makeup so quickly it's funny I didn't have to go back in though and blend a few things but we're all good now let me show you guys what I'm planning on wearing I am kind of torn because I really want to dress casual but I have to dress for both things that I'm doing so I have to get lasered and like go to a cafe in which are both very casual attire would do but i also have the event in brooklyn at seven and i don't want to go there looking casual i don't live in the city and i'm not going to come home and then go back i mean that's stupid so i'm just going to take one stone and kill two birds so i'm gonna go with this white turtleneck thing and this is from aritzia and these white trouser pants are from aritzia as well and then i'm just gonna put this very large overcoat on top in hopes that that's gonna kind of classy things up not exactly sure if i'm gonna wear this for sure though but um, it might change it might not but this is the plan for right now so i'm now going to get dressed and i'll come back and show you guys the finished look so a lot of you guys were asking me the other day to like does this hair hold curl very well and honestly i'm gonna say no um but with a little hairspray and stuff that does go a pretty long way so it will hold curls once you put a little hairspray in it and the curls will not go anywhere i'm also not great at curling hair anyways so maybe it's just also the technique that i'm using all right i think my hair is done this is what we're looking like just like a very regular like curling situation um i'm going to now switch out my jewelry i'm gonna leave the bracelets on this is just the croissant um bracelet sorry can you focus okay croissant um cuff bracelet the dome cup bracelet and this is just the serpentine croissant ring dome ring i'm gonna leave these on i just want to change out um actually i might change the rings too hold on i went in with the charlotte these are just a little bit nicer and i just think they're a little bit more fancy so this is the charlotte um bold hoops both of them and i went in with the charlotte bold ring on this hand and the charlotte thin ring on the other hand um, I'm just gonna leave it like this for today. I might add a little sparkle maybe on my pointy finger. This is what I arrived at. This is the diamond X ring with one of the wishbone stacker, the sparkly part. This is the Pave 
diamond signet ring or signet ring. So I'm officially ready to head out. I'm just gonna add the finishing touches to my bag. Um, I have my camera, all my camera stuff. I have to bring it because I really wanna just get some edit while I'm out. I do have like a three hour window that I'm not doing anything and I might as well use that time to work. Um, I have everything that I need here. Um, wallet and everything. I don't really need anything else. Face mask, I have one right here. So yeah, I'll see you guys at the train station because I don't want to be late. I made it to the train station on time. I'm literally um, just on time. Um, I, um, I got here literally on time. My train leaves in literally two minutes. Um, so I'm just here on time. Why do I keep repeating myself? Like when people watch me vlog, I get nervous and I instantly like lose my train of thought. But um, I have some iced coffee here. This is a grande iced coffee with chestnut praline syrup with praline on top. Um, I'm not having milk, so I'm just having it black and plain. Ooh, is that my train? Is that my train? Is that my train? Yep, let me go you guys, cause I can't come this far to miss it. So I just finished my laser appointment. Um, it was so painful. I don't care what anyone says. It feels like someone's taking like 10 needles, hot needles and like poking them at you like repeatedly, repeatedly for like 10 minutes. <laughs> so yeah, anyways, it's done though. She does, she did however tell me that though, with each session they do go up in like levels. So that's why it's a little bit, bit more painful now that it's my third. But it's not terrible and I love the results. Like the hair under my armpits are no longer growing back. And if it does, it's like two and three hair. Bikini line, bikini area, Brazilian is completely lessened as well. No more razor bumps. It's getting clearer and clearer by the minute. So I really love the results for that. Um, however, it's not permanent. I'll probably will have to come back and kind of do a retouch every now and again, but the fact that the hair barely grows back and takes weeks and months, I'm I'll, I'm sold. So, yeah, definitely check out Laser Away and call someone and try to like negotiate a good rate, and you can get your sessions. But that's what I did, and I got a really good deal. I believe, believe I paid like two thousand for eight underarm sessions and eight Brazilian sessions, which is, I think, a great deal compared to this um, the prices I've seen elsewhere. Right, guys all done with the laser and look at me vlogging in new york city i don't even vlog in my own state which is only jersey it's not like i'm like worlds away but um new york is like way busier but i feel like new yorkers are more um they're used to this kind of thing people are always here shooting themselves doing that whole thing so they don't really stare as you stare at you as much but in new jersey like there's absolutely like no vloggers and stuff or right? i mean there is Okay, we're all good. I'll be there at 7.30 or so. Thanks, guys. Um, that was my um, manager. She texted me to let me know that the influencer event that we're going to requires us to be um, fully vaccinated. Um, so here's the deal on that, right? I am fully vaxxed. However, the picture I have in my phone is of my one shot only. I haven't taken an updated photo yet, but I ended up finding my vaccination card. So I'll be able to just bring it. I, I just inquired because I was like, crap, the picture I have is only of the one shot and they're going to think I only have one shot when in fact I, only, I have two. But, uh, and I don't know if there's a digital version yet of the vaccination cards yet but um, either way it's fine it works out i found it and 
potato potato right anyways let me head to the cafe i wanted to go to the one over here called blue stone lane but they close at 3 30 it's now 3 33 and i'm just trying to find another one anyways i'm gonna stare at now so let me go Anyways, made it to the sushi shop. I went with this place called Amber. Um, we'll let you know how it is at the end because we, we haven't really eaten anything yet. Let's try the miso soup though. Um, miso soup is always a, if they can't get the miso right, we might as well just prepare it. <laughs> I'm going to just put the camera here. Love that for us. <laughs> but it was so cute, you guys. Was, we had the old Yes. And we had like some like Flower Brahms um, drink. It was pretty sweet. Very true to its name. Um, now we're going to probably head head out. You guys have not been in the city all day. And um, our feet hurt, so. Yeah. Anyways, let us. Um, this is Alexia, by the way, you guys. Um, so, Alexia, your bag's right here, okay? Sorry. Okay. Thank you. 